Okay, man, if there's any fanchies that are listening right now, you have to watch tonight's episode called Bloodlines. Stop listening right now, man. Major spoilers. I don't know how else to approach this podcast for tonight's episode without spoiling pretty much everything. Um, what I won't spoil is what happened in the Solomon storyline. That we won't touch. We won't touch that at all because the way that it was presented to us, you know, the fans of, of, of Banshee was so perfect as far as a cinematic presentation that you have to witness it. So I'm not going to do that, okay? What I will talk about, let's talk about let's talk about the Carrie Hopewell um, storyline. Let's let's talk about how she's doing right now. She's currently in prison. She is currently being ignored by her family, which is heartbreaking. I mean, it, it literally is, man. Like, um, and, and the way that they film this thing, it's crazy because tonight's episode starts off, man, with this, which, what, what I thought for, gosh, man, for the entire time until they reveal that it's not what you think it is. It starts off with uh, Carrie being reunited with her husband and uh, her husband, Gordon. And then all of a sudden, you know, he brings her back home and she gets to see her kids. She gets a warming, uh, loving embrace, man, by her children. Oh, except, you know, D uh, Diva. Um, because for some reason, you know, she's a little hesitant. But then she finally comes in. So they're a family unit. Then all of a sudden, you see Anna walk out of the house. And, and this is, I'm dead serious. And when I say this, this is absolutely, it's, 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 I'm serious when I say this. Carrie's wearing, you know, blonde hair, um, blonde hair, brunette hair, whatever you want to call it. And then you see Carrie walk out and she has black hair on. All of a sudden you're like, what? Like, when, when did, when, how was, how was this possible? How was, I don't know. I don't know how they did it. Um, but it looked, it looked perfect. It looked amazing. And she walks out of the house and then all of a sudden Carrie turns around and where her husband Gordon is at, you now see Lucas Hood. And, and it, it's crazy. It's it's not Lucas Hood standing in his in, in his police uniform. No, it's Lucas Hood, um, standing there inside of the the suit that that uh that that Gordon was wearing. And I, I don't even I don't even know what happened, man. Um, you know, obviously she wakes up from the dream. It's a dream sequence, and she's back in prison, and she's laying in her bed, her her prison bed, and uh, she has her her pictures of her kids. Um, kind of like tucked underneath the mattress of the person that's sleeping above her, and then you know you're snapped back into reality, man. It was I don't know. I guess for me it was like this moment where I thought, okay, maybe you know the 30 days is already over with, and and she's she's back into the fold. She everything's okay, you know. And all of a sudden, man, you know, this show, man, you know, with Cinemax, they 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 cut you, they snap you back into reality so fast you don't know, like. <laughs> They just they make sure that you know, okay, hey, you're watching Banshee. Anything can happen. Um, what you think you know, you don't know. And, and, and I, oh, my gosh, man. Yeah, just just beautiful. Beautiful scene tonight, man. Um, we're going to fast forward now, man, to the end of the episode. And once again, man, it caught me by surprise because I didn't know anything. I, di I didn't know what was going to happen, man. Um, y you see uh, two guards. They come in. They get Carrie from her cell they walk her over and they're like inside there and then she looks inside and it's this it's this cell it's empty and then she turns around to the guard she's like in there and she's like yeah and they kind of push her in there and as soon as she walks in there they slam the door shut and then you see this woman that Carrie's standing in front of she's dressed in white um and then Carrie starts walking towards her I was thinking you know okay maybe this is someone that Carrie knew in the past um, you know, maybe this is somebody, you know, talking to her about her case. <laughs> then all of a sudden, man, the, the camera, you know, is, is, is over Carrie's shoulder, over her, uh, her right shoulder. And then it snaps it. It pans to the right real quick. I mean, it's so quick. Like, it actually scared me, man. Like, seriously, I was like, whoa! Like, it, it really freaked me out, man. And then who do you see there? Yes, Rabbit. Rabbit is back. Rabbit has returned. And we have to talk about this, man. We have to sit down and we have to break this down word by word, section by section, and we have to just understand, you know, what does this mean now? That's what's so crazy about tonight's episode, man. Um, Once again, man, 10 out of 10 stars. It's an amazing episode. It's called Bloodlines. A lot of stuff happened. We're going to be right back. 
to talk about it again, man. We're out of here. Thanks again for listening.